Hello guys, my name is Pratham Vishal Rajawada. I am in Sex Triangle and I am from Nanta Sleep in Kakopo East. I hope that you all are fine in this difficult situation. I feel very bored because no going out to play with friends, no going to garden, only sitting at home. And the main point, no going to school. But I have a solution for it. So please watch the video till end. See guys, I have a collection of books. But I know you are thinking why I am telling you, showing you the collection of books. Because today my topic is sharing my experience of my favorite book. So guys, let's get started. See my collection of books. So I am going to tell you about my favorite book. See guys, this is my favorite book, 121 Bedtime Stories. I know you all are feeling that this book is for kids because, because this cartoon images. But no, this cartoon images are only for fun. This book can be read for all the ages people. And this, this story has not only 10 or 20 stories. It has total 121 stories. See guys, this is the index of total 121 stories. Do you like this? So guys, I am going to tell you one story of this book. I like this book very much. If you want this book, you can buy it from the store or you can order it online. This book is available at online also. So guys, I am going to tell you about the story A Gold Star and a Cute Boy Jenry. So let's get started with the story. Jenry had a wonderful dream about floating through the sky in a silver boat and collecting stars in a large bag. He was, it was so marvelous. But with morning came back school. He got dressed and dragged himself to the bus. Back to maths and grammar. He thought, no silver boat and no stars. He found grammar so dull. What with all kinds of sentences and pronouns and cases. Oh dear, it was going to be a rough day. And there was a maths test too. He took the test with the rest of the class. The other students were writing the paper so seriously. Dear God, he prayed, please help me. The bell rang and he gave his book to Miss Little. The teacher, when, he, when she returned later, she gave the student their book. Jamri started looking at his book and what he saw? A golden star with full marks in his exam paper. So guys, did you understand? He studied very effortly. So, so he get a golden star. So guys, you also study very properly in your exams and get full marks. So guys, you got a good moral no, from this storybook. So you should always read at least one hour in a day storybooks. You have to promise me that you will read at least one hour in a day storybooks. So guys, so guys, I, I know that you are thinking that reading storybooks are so boring. I feel bored. So guys, I have some points from which you can get encouraged to read books. First point, it also, uh, it, uh, it boosts your sleep. It, it improves your vocabulary and it also brightens your day. Okay, so guys, don't forget to read a storybook once a day. So guys, if you like my video, please like it, share it to everyone and your friends and family members. Bye!